A monkey bit me. I said it's gonna be okay, but I got bit by a monkey. Oh shit. It's the bag. Meg, you gotta stand up. Like you said, you gotta stand up. Stand up and walk. Alright, just keep walking. Just walk, 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 walk. You gotta walk. Give me a hand. <laughs> so, I got bit by a monkey while I was at the Boon Monkey Forest. And this really sucks. Like, I mean, it was completely surprising. Um, I wasn't expecting it at all. The reason why it sucks is because I wasn't one of those tourists who was trying to pet the monkey or take a selfie with them or help them at like a water fountain. I was just walking along the path and minding my own business, but the monkey just came. It jumped onto my shorts, climbed up. I didn't move because we're told not to move when they climb here. You just walk and then it just bit my hand. And yeah, I got bit by a monkey. So yeah, that's the first reason it sucks, because it could happen to anyone, even if you're not doing anything that you shouldn't be doing. Second reason is that you're going to have to go through the medical steps in order to make sure that you don't get sick. Now, there are three different sicknesses that you could be exposed to. The first one, number one, be tetanus. So if you have your tetanus shots, you should be okay, but otherwise you'll have to get tetanus shots. The second one is that uh, just local infections from the monkey being dirty, climbing things, walking, uh, doing whatever they do, but the recommendation is to just clean your wound for about 15 minutes uh, really, really well with antibacterial soap. That should be okay. And now the third thing is rabies. So in Ubud, in Bali, there hasn't been a case of rabies from a monkey bite since 2008, but there are still rabies on the island. So they do recommend to get the rabies shots. Now, the bite can be classified into three different levels. Level number one is, well, if they don't bite you, if they lick you, maybe a little bit of scratch. In that case, you need no shots. Level number two is if they bite you, but the skin isn't broken, so no blood is exposed, uh, the monkey saliva does not go and mix with your blood. In this case, the recommendation is to get rabies vaccines, which you need to do on two on day one, one on day seven, and one on day 21. If the monkey comes and bites your skin and breaks your skin, and there's a little bit of blood involved, that's level three, which is what happened to me, which means I had to do the same thing as level two. But on top of that, you also need to take something which is called rabies immunoglobulin. That is real expensive. So if you don't have travel insurance, then, that sucks. Luckily I did. So I would say go to the monkey forest. Monkeys are cool, but just know that they might bite you. Enjoy the monkeys.